Um, good evening, Robin, right? And good evening, everybody. Uh, I'm Pier Paolo from uh, Turin, uh, in the north. Um, I brought a few lines um, because I don't feel comfortable to speak uh, in public. And um, I'm um, kind of um, overhand by the emotion of, me of meeting my favorite uh, actress. Pronto, pronto, pronto. Okay. I can't believe I get, I get the, the chance to, uh, to speak to you, watching your beautiful uh, eyes. And the first time I saw your eyes, <laughs> no, please, <laughs> it's difficult. <laughs> yes, the first time I watched your eyes, I was 10 years old. And um, I deeply believed that your name was Kelly Capwell <laughs> and that you lived in Santa Barbara. But when you got kidnapped, raped, almost killed, kidnapped again several times in a few months by the creepy carnation killer, mm -hmm. I began to suspect that Kelly Keppel could be not real. How perceptive. <laughs> Back then you were supposed to play the ingenue, but you always played that role with a rebel attitude. That contrast made me feel, fell in love with you along with your spontaneity, I think, I hope this is the right word, in acting, which you still have. Hai una domanda? Per favore, lo aspetto da una vita. <laughs> um, He has been waiting for it. I've been life. following your amazing career since then, and I got proof. proof. Um, you gave us amazing and unforgettable performances in movies like Sorry Haters, People Lee, The Conspirator, The Congress, uh, just to quote my favorites. And you keep amazing me, showing your talents as, as a director. I watched Land in the most terrible time of my life. And I can tell you how much that movie inspired me and gave me strength to go home. Thank you for this, too. Oh. <laughs> it has been exciting to see your, you blossom, blossoming through the years. Speaking of flowers, I will say that the young, unexperienced white carnation, movie after movie, turned out to be a strong and confident white oleander. I hope you got to the... I hope you got to the floral references, <laughs> I think so. <laughs> but I have been speaking for too long. So I must go straight to my first question. Yes, I have two questions, please, but very quick. My friend Nicholas Koster, Lionel Lockridge, told me that you used to bring with you your three-legged dog on the set of Santa Barbara. Can I ask you what was its name? Because I'm looking for inspiration to name my next dog. And the second question is the most naive ever. Please, can I shake your hand? Take a pic together and get the pic I brought with me signed? When I wake up tomorrow, I need evidence for my husband to be that this has really happened, or he will, ca he will call me a mythomaniac. I know, less is more, <laughs> as you say, but I had to try. Thank you. <laughs> that is he's not a something, that something not a <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you for that. So Swede made me cry. My dog had three legs. And it was a sharpe. And in Japanese, wrinkle. You know, wrinkle. Rugetta. Rugetta. Rugen. The word is shiwa. So I named her Shiwa because she was the Sharpe with all the wrinkles. You know Nick Coster? Yeah. We, we did the uh, um, Santa Barbara Union Cruise three years ago. Oh, ago. yes, of course. With uh, A. Martinez. With A. Martinez. And uh, Nick Coster. Oh, my God. All right, I'll come down and take a picture after. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> Grazie. Un'altra domanda? Wonder Woman e ci saranno Robin Wright e Patty Jenkins che lo introdurranno. Vi voglio ricordare, scusatemi, voglio ricordarvi che in questo momento all'open space, eh, qui accanto alla PT, sta iniziando proprio in questo momento un incontro molto interessante con Francesca Barra per presentare il suo ultimo Francesca Barra, se volete, è appena cominciato, quindi... Eh, troverete sia Francesca Barra che Claudio Santamaria. Grazie.
I never really knew why she came back. But I didn't care. It was like olden times. We was like peas and carrots again. <laughs> <laughs>